this is to DIY for and today a super simple easy way to customize and personalize a beach towel for you this technique can actually be used on a variety of different fabrics so you could even apply this to say a t-shirt if you want so let's just get right into it so all you need is a towel and some bleach and a spray bottle. I have the X-Acto knife, a pen, and a piece of styrofoam board just so I can make my stencil. So that's what I'm doing here. I took this pineapple image from the internet, I'm just using it as a guide, and I am freehanding it on my piece of styrofoam board. So once you are completed with this, you can definitely print an image off. Uh, it makes it a lot easier instead of having to draw it. Just grab your X-Acto knife and you're going to cut out the pieces to create your stencil. Stencil. So I just went ahead and popped out all of those pieces from the styrofoam board and like I said it's a lot easier if you just use a printed image you can get it big enough. Keep in mind everything you're popping out is going to be white, everything else is going to be the color of whatever material you're working with. So that's what mine looked like when I was done. Pretty happy with how it turned out considering I freehanded it. Uh, then I just took my towel outside and I thought it was best because some bleach might leak. So just in case, I brought it outside, laid my stencil down. These extra pieces of material are just so any of the spray from the spray bottle doesn't get anywhere else on my towel. And that is just straight up bleach in the spray bottle. So spraying my entire design and just trying to make sure it goes straight down so none of it gets underneath the stencil so we can get a nice clean line. I did go back and spray some extra in. Uh, I left this for about 10-15 minutes. Leave it your desired time. So it gets really white the longer that you leave it. I did go back and I kind of sprayed some splotchy spots around and that's it. So I love how my towel turned out and honestly the stencil took the longest so if you're already using a stencil that is pre-made um, it is going to take you 5-10 minutes to do this because it doesn't really take all that long for the bleach to pull out all of the color. Do make sure you are working with something that has a lot of color in it and also is like a deep darker color. It is going to work best with that. And apply this technique to maybe a t-shirt. You could design something fun that way as well. I'd love to see what you do with this. Send me some photos if you try out this DIY. You can follow me on Instagram or on Twitter at Janelle Steeper. And then just use the hashtag 2DIY4 if you tag me in any of those photos. Don't forget to subscribe next Wednesday of course I'll be back with a new DIY cheers forget to subscribe 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 subscribe